My name is Dr. Brett Belchett. I am the CEO and co-founder at Maple. I'm also a emergency room physician. I've practiced in the Toronto area for about 15 years. Maple is a virtual care platform that launched in 2015. And what we do is we provide a platform that allows Canadians across the country to log in from a mobile app or from any web-enabled computer and click a button to be connected to doctors for healthcare concerns. Having a technology like ours that allows patients to see doctors from the comfort of their home is actually a safety imperative. It's allowing lots of patients to continue to receive care even when they're worried about the safety of the doctor's office and may not physically be willing to travel there. We have adapted by rapidly onboarding a lot more physicians. So we've added on about 75 more doctors in the last three or four days. So what will happen is a physician will accept your request for a COVID-19 screening consultation. They will speak to you on a video chat, uh, understand what your symptoms are, take a look at you to see how sick you are, and then give you the appropriate advice whether or not this is something that you should be managing at home in self-isolation, whether or not you have nothing at all that you need to be doing because you're well, whether or not you need testing under provincial resources and where to go for that testing, or whether or not you look very sick and should be going to the emergency room. Being an emergency room physician, I can tell you that our emergency rooms are overrun. We have eight hour waits at my emergency room for people just to find out that they actually don't need to get a COVID-19 test. It's actually making it very difficult for the hospitals to keep up. So for all those cases of people who actually don't need a swab and probably can just self-manage at home, it's really important for us to have a solution like this where patients can be seen on video and be told that from the comfort and safety of their home. It's been a, a, a really incredible thing to see how our team has come together, both on the clinical side and on the technology side, to be able to service just such an unbelievable and unprecedented ramp up and demand in such a short amount of time and I would say to anybody out there who is sick or just need, has routine medical needs really consider during this time of crisis seeing a doctor remotely before you go to see a doctor in person every time you go to a crowded waiting room even if you're not sick now there's a chance that you might be exposed to something and certainly if you are sick you don't want to be the person that goes to a crowded waiting room and makes others sick.